Question number 1. Find the modulus and the argument of the complex number. Is it is equal to minus 1 minus i root 3. So, we have to find the complex number. What is the modulus? That is the argument. The modulus is the same. That is the argument. The theta is the same. Is it is equal to minus 1 minus i root 3. That is, is it is equal to x plus i y. In the angle, x and the x and the minus 1 num, y and the value minus root 3 on it. x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to minus root 3. Therefore, mod is equal to root of square root of x square plus y square. Mod is equal to square root of x square plus y square on x, x in the value minus 1 on therefore minus 1 the all square plus y is equal to minus root 3. Minus root 3 the all square. That is equal to minus 1 the all square that is 1 plus root, uh, minus root 3 the all square. That is 3 on 1 plus 3 uh, square root of 4 on the modulus value on that is square root of 4 is equal to 2. Now modulus on the modulus on the is equal to 2 on the result. Now we have to the theta on the theta on the x in the value minus 1 and y in the value minus root 3 in the Then, we have the theta on the end the. Therefore, let alpha is equal to alpha in the value tan inverse y by x construe the. Then, y is equal to y is equal to minus root 3. That is tan inverse mode minus root 3 divided by minus 1. That is equal to tan inverse root 3. Tan inverse root, root 3 is equal to pi by 3. Aana. Okay, but alpha in the value we have to write the pi by 3. Now, we have to x and y in the values. Nukka x in the value, y in the value and random negative numbers are. So, point is lies on the third quadrant. Random negative i don't and either quadrant will add to third quadrant. Varega. Third quadrant will add to the theta and add to the theta is equal to yana, minus of pi minus alpha. Yarikim. Alpha is equal to pi by 3. Yana, Therefore, theta is equal to minus of pi minus alpha. That is equal to minus of pi minus alpha yana. alpha yana value pi by 3 yana. therefore minus of pi minus pi by 3 then we get minus 2 pi by 3 appo so, namukku theta etrayana kittiyathu amplitude of z ennu parayunnathu minus 2 pi by 3 yana result kittiyirikkunnathu ivada namukku r inde value namukku kittiyunnathu 2 um theta eda value minus 2 pi by 3 yana polar formula is equal to r cos theta plus i sin theta. That is r is equal to two minus two pi by three. Then two cos theta plus i sin theta. That is r is equal to two. That is two into cos theta the value that we get minus two pi by three. That is two cos minus two pi by three plus i sin minus two pi by three. We know that cos minus theta is equal to cos theta and sin minus theta is equal to minus sin theta. So we can write is it is equal to two cos two pi by three minus i sin two pi by three. Question number 2. Find the modulus and the argument of the complex number. Is it is equal to minus root 3 plus i. For complex number is modulus. That is argument. Here, is it is equal to minus root 3 plus i. Here, x is equal to minus root 3 and y is equal to 1. x in the value minus root 3 and y in the value is 1. Anna. So, mod is equal to mod is equal to square root of x square plus y square. That is minus root 3 the all square plus 1 square that is equal to root of 3 plus 1 that is root 4 is equal to 2. Modus is equal to modus is modulus value anna, that is 2 and anna, that is equal to modus is equal to theta and do dikana. is it is equal to minus root 3 plus i anna. here x is equal to minus root 3 and y is equal to 1 therefore alpha is equal to tan inverse mod y by x anna. y the value 1 anna x in the value minus root 3 anna. substitute aim of tan inverse mod 1 divided by minus root 3 in the that's equal to modulus i the one the tan inverse 1 by root 3 in the tan inverse 1 by root 3 at pi by 6 anna value pa alpha da value namakku kittiyirikkunnathu pi by 6 ennalladana value kittiyirikkunnathu ini namakku adhe quadrant il aanu nammude complex number varunne ennu nokkanam here x in the value negative um y the value endana positive aanu kittiyirikkunnathu that means x uh, that means x negative aanu le x negative um y da value endana positive aanu appo second quadrant il irikkum nammude ee complex number undavva so z belongs to second quadrant therefore we can write theta theta nu parayunnathu engane irikkum pi minus alpha irikkum second quadrant il anengil pi il ninnu namukku ee kittirikkunna alpha endeyanam avada ninnu korakkanam that's equal to pi minus alpha is equal to pi by 6 
therefore pi minus pi by 6 newton. That's equal to 6 pi minus 5 that is 5 pi by 6 and all that. Theta written there. That is the amplitude of z is equal to that is theta is equal to 5 pi by 6 newton. So, we can see the modulus of the amplitude of the amplitude. That is the value of the value. That is the value of the polar formula. What is the polar formula? Is it equal to r into cos theta plus i sin theta? That is polar form. That is 2 into cos 5 pi by 6 plus i sin 5 by 6. Question number 3. Find the polar form of the complex number. Is it equal to 1 minus i? Now, we will see the complex number 1 minus i. That question is the polar formula represent. Now, we will see the polar formula. We will see the polar formula. We will see the polar formula. Is it equal to x plus i y? Here, x is equal to 1. x is equal to 1. y is equal to minus 1. Then, we will see the polar formula. Polar form is equal to r into cos theta plus i sin theta n all that one complex number in the polar form. But if we look at r, we will see theta. If we look at r is equal to mod is equal to square root of that is x square is equal to 1 square root of y value is minus 1. That is 1 square plus minus 1 d all square. That is equal to root 2 n all that one mod is equal to theta. This is the value of theta value. Here x is equal to 1 and y is equal to minus 1. Therefore, alpha is equal to tan inverse y by x. That is tan inverse minus 1 by 1. That is modulus of minus 1 by 1. That is equal to tan inverse 1. Tan inverse 1 is pi by 4. So, we have alpha value in the value pi by 4. Then, x is equal to 1 and y is equal to minus 1. Now, we have to look at the quadrant. x is equal to positive 1. Positive one, that's all, and wide value is negative one. Now, what quadrant is going to add? The fourth quadrant is going to add. We can do this complex number. That means, in the fourth quadrant, we can add theta. Theta is equal to minus alpha. Alpha is going to add theta. That's the negative value. Therefore, what is the alpha? Pi by 4. Therefore, theta is equal to minus pi by 4. That's our amplitude. That is, theta is equal to minus alpha, that is equal to minus pi by 4. Then, if we have R and R and R, the modus and the value and the value and the theta value. What do we represent in this way? What do we represent in this way? Is it is equal to R into cos theta plus i sin theta. Then we get R into cos theta plus i sin theta. That is equal to R is root 2. Root 2 into cos minus pi by 4 plus i sin minus pi by 4. Question number 4. Find the polar form of the complex number is it is equal to minus 1 plus i. So, we have to find the complex number is minus 1 plus i. So, that is the polar formula. First of all, we have to find mod z. Mod z is equal to square root of x square plus y square. Here, x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to 1. Then, we get square root of minus 1 to all square plus 1 square. That is equal to minus 1 to all square and then 1 and then 1 plus 1 and then root 2 and the result 2. Then we have to find the amplitude. Theta is the same as the amplitude. Now theta is the value of the amplitude. We have to find the complex number. Minus 1 plus i is the complex number. Here x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to 1. Now x is the value of the negative. That is the value of the y value. That is the positive. Now what is the value of the value? Second quarter in the area, we have this complex number. Then, we have to find the alpha. Alpha is equal to tan inverse y by x. That is, y is equal to 1 and x is equal to minus 1. Substitute in tan inverse 1 by minus 1. Mod is that is tan inverse again 1 by 1. 1 is equal to tan inverse 1 by minus 1. Alpha is equal to pi by 4. Alpha is equal to pi by 4. Pi by 4. We have already said that this is a complex number. P of z is a point that is not the second quarter. If we have a second quarter, we have a complex number. Theta is equal to pi minus alpha. Theta is equal to amplitude. That is equal to pi minus. Alpha is equal to pi by 4. Therefore, 4 pi minus pi by 4. That is 3 pi by 4. Theta value is equal to theta. Therefore, the amplitude of z argument that is theta is equal to 3 pi by 4 in the result duty. Now, we have to say that theta is equal to theta. This is the polar representation. 
that is z is equal to minus 1 plus i de polar form endana r into cos theta plus i sin theta ana r de value endayirunnu r de value root 2 theta de value namaku kittirunnathu 3 pi by 4 u aanu therefore the uh, polar representation is z is equal to root 2 into cos 3 pi by 4 plus i sin 3 pi by 4 question number 5 find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 1 minus i First of all, we have to find mod z. Mod z is equal to square root of x square plus y square. Here x is equal to minus 1 and y is equal to minus 1. Real and imaginary part of the world is equal to minus 1. So, we have to find mod z is equal to substitute u and x square and the path and the way minus 1 the all square plus y square. That is minus 1 the all square. That is equal to root 2 in the bitty. Mod z and value in the bitty. Root 2 and all that mod, modulus of is all that. Next, we have to find theta. Theta the value and all that one to Theta the value and all that one x minus 1 and y minus 1 and all So, alpha is equal to tan inverse y by x and tan inverse minus 1 by minus 1. That's equal to tan inverse 1 and all that. Tan inverse 1 and all that one pi by 4 and Therefore, alpha is equal to pi by 4. Then, x and y and all negative numbers and so, this quadrant is like x, y, negative. So, this quadrant is third quadrant. Third quadrant is theta. Theta is equal to minus of pi minus alpha. Next, we have to find the theta value. Theta minus of pi minus alpha. Pi minus alpha. Next, we have to find the theta value. Pi by 4 is equal to pi by 4. Therefore, minus of pi minus pi by 4. That is, minus of pi minus pi by 4 is equal to, minus which bracket open g on here, minus pi plus pi by 4. That is equal to minus 4 pi plus pi divided by 4. That is, uh, 3 minus 3 pi by 4 in the result. Then, theta value minus 3 pi by 4. That is, we have to get the R value. We have to get the root 2 and the R value. We have to substitute the polar representative. R value is substituted the value. Then, we get root 2 into cos minus 3 pi by 4 plus i sin minus 3 pi by 4. Sixth question. Find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 1 minus i. Now, we have to find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 1 minus i. Now, we have to find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 3. Now, we have to find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 3. Now, we have to find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 3. Now, we have to find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to minus 3. अब कॉम्प्लेक्स नंबर ला, नमक तो अंदर इकिन्ना रियल पार्ट मात्रा ओल्लो, अपन नमला इंगेने इड नम ए प्लस आई बी फॉर्मूले के इड गा, दैट इस माइनस थ्री प्लस सीरो आई नो एरिप, दैट्स इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री प्लस सीरो आई, हियर एक्स इज इक्वल टू माइनस थ्री एंड वाई इज इक्वल टू सीरो, देवरफॉर मोड 3 and all that is answered. So, we have to do the modulus. We have to do the theta. We have to do the theta. We have to do the polar representation. We have to do the substitute. Z is equal to minus 3. That is equal to x plus i y. Here x is equal to minus 3. And y is equal to 0. Let alpha is equal to tan inverse mod y by x. Y value is 0. 0 divided by minus 3. We have to do tan inverse 0. 0 by minus 3. 0 divided by minus 3 आण, that's equal to tan inverse 0 नु वरियम, tan inverse 0 एत्र आण, 0 आण. अप नमक्क तन्दिरिक्किन्न पोईंट नोगीके, minus 3 एन्न उल्ला दाण, नम्मड पोईंट. minus 3 एन्न वरियम बत्तेनम, एद आण, अवड imaginary part इल्ला, imaginary part इल्लांगिल तन्ने Imagine part is not, we will get 0. Minus 3 is 0, we will get x axis. Now, we will get x axis, we will get complex number. So, the amplitude of theta is equal to pi. Theta is equal to pi. Therefore, the polar form of z is equal to minus 3 is r into cos theta plus i sin theta. Substitute a and the value is r into 3. That is 3 into cos pi plus i sin pi. Question number 7. Find the modulus and the argument of the complex number. Z is equal to root 3 plus i. So, we have to show you the argument and the modulus. So, we have to show you the question. 
real part is root 3 varium, imaginary part is 1. That is x is equal to root 3 and y is equal to 1. Therefore, mod is equal to square root of x square plus y square. That is square root of root 3 square plus 1 square. That is equal to square root of 3 plus 1. Root 3 the all square that is 3. 3 plus 1 that is square root of 4. That is equal to 2. Mod is 2 in the day. Alpha is equal to tan inverse y by x. Substitute here. Y by x in the values of substitute here. Tan inverse 1 by root 3 in the term. That is equal to tan inverse 1 by root 3 in pi by 6. So, we will see that x in the y in values are positive. So, that point lies on the first quadrant. Therefore, we can say that theta is equal to alpha. 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 First quadrant lies on the first quadrant. Theta is equal to alpha. Theta is equal to alpha. So, alpha is equal to alpha. Pi by 6. Therefore, the amplitude of z is equal to pi by 6. Then, we can represent the complex, uh, complex number in the polar form. z is equal to r cos theta plus i sin theta. That is 2 into cos pi by 6 plus i sin pi by 6. Question number 8. Find the polar form of the complex number z is equal to i. Here, complex number is z is equal to i. Then, the real part is real part. So, x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1. Mod z is equal to mod is equal to square root of x square plus y square. Here, x in the value is x equal to 0 and 0 square plus 1 square. The answer is 1. Now, mod is the value of 1. We have a polar formula represent here. That means, z is equal to r into cos theta plus i sin theta. We have a polar form. Now, what is the value of r? r is equal to mod is the value of r. We have a value of 1. We have a theta. We have a value of the amplitude. Here, x is equal to 0 and y is equal to 1. Let alpha is equal to tan inverse y by x. Here y is equal to 1 and x is equal to 0. Le. But tan inverse 1 by 0. Item. Tan inverse 1 by 0 is tan inverse infinity. Tan inverse infinity is 3 and we value it another pi by 2. Pa alpha is equal to pi by 2. Aana. Then, we have complex number. No ke, I is the complex number. Na ne, that means real part is the real part. Illa, le, zero is the real part. Then, we have a ordered pair. Like so, we will represent this complex number in 0, 1 and 0. 0, 1 and 0 complex number. If we denote this complex plane in a point, 0, 1 and 0 point is the positive y axis. Because x coordinate is 0 and y coordinate is 1. That is the positive y axis. This is the particular point. This is the particular point. So, the complex number is the point. The point that means the complex number is set on the positive y axis. Then we can find the amplitude. Amplitude of z is equal to theta is equal to pi by 2. Theta in the same that equal same idea that is equal to pi by 2. Then the answer is Then theta value r value substitute m. r is equal to modis rana. So we can do r value 1 and then theta value pi by 2 and then we can do it. Therefore, z is equal to 1 into cos pi by 2 plus i sin pi by 2.